Have you ever wondered how your mental health affects your performance at work? It's a question that resonates with us all, especially in today's fast-paced world. Mental health is the cornerstone of our overall well-being, and it's just as important as our physical health. It significantly influences how we think, feel, and act, shaping our ability to handle stress, make decisions, and build relationships. In recent years, companies have begun to recognize the critical role that mental health plays in the workplace. They understand that a mentally healthy workforce is not just happier, but also more productive and engaged. However, even with increased efforts, many employees still find themselves grappling with mental health issues. We can't ignore the fact that there's a gap between the growing emphasis on mental health and the actual well-being of employees. So it's time to ask ourselves, what can we do to enhance our mental health at work? Firstly, it's crucial to foster a culture of well-being. This is not just about having a nice office space or a coffee machine, it goes much deeper. It's about creating an atmosphere where everyone feels included and valued. It's about making sure that every single person in the organization feels comfortable enough to talk about their mental health without fear of being judged or stigmatized. This kind of supportive environment can help individuals feel more at ease more understood, and ultimately, more productive. It encourages people to look out for one another, fostering a sense of community and shared responsibility. So remember, a supportive work environment is the first step towards better mental health. Secondly, encouraging a healthy work-life balance is key. It's about setting clear boundaries between professional responsibilities and personal pursuits. Think of it like this. Work is a part of life, not the entirety of it. When we blur these lines, we risk overworking, which often leads to burnout and stress. These are not just terms thrown around lightly, they are serious conditions that can negatively impact mental health. It's like running a marathon without any rest stops. Eventually, the body gives out. The same goes for our minds. Encouraging a work-life balance doesn't mean shirking responsibilities, but rather managing them in a way that also allows time for rest, relaxation, and personal growth. A balanced life equals a healthier mind. Thirdly, providing mental health resources is essential. It's not just about recognizing the importance of mental health, but also about backing it up with tangible support. Imagine a workplace where counseling services are readily available, where mental health days are not just allowed but encouraged, and where stress management is not a mere concept, but a practice taught in workshops. These resources can serve as lifelines for employees navigating through tough times. They can be the difference between struggling in silence and seeking help. They can transform a stressful environment into a supportive one. And it's not just the employees who benefit. A healthier, happier workforce is a more productive one, which is a win-win for everyone involved. With the right resources, we can all take better care of our mental health. Fourthly, practicing mindfulness can make a big difference. Imagine this. You're in a busy workplace. Your mind is racing with thoughts, deadlines, and meetings. It's easy to get lost in the chaos. This is where mindfulness steps in. It's a way to bring your attention back to the present moment, to focus on what is happening right now. And how does this help? By reducing stress for one. When we're present, we're not worrying about the past or the future. We're here, and that's a stress relief in itself. Moreover, mindfulness can boost focus and productivity. It allows us to concentrate on one task at a time, reducing distractions and increasing efficiency. So, how about setting aside a few minutes each day for mindfulness or meditation? It's like a mini vacation for your mind in the midst of a busy day. Mindfulness is a powerful tool for mental wellness. Finally, open communication is key. It's a vital strategy in fostering better mental health at the workplace. Imagine a work environment where everyone feels comfortable discussing their mental health concerns as easily as they would a physical ailment. By creating an atmosphere that encourages open and honest discussions about mental health, we can challenge the stigma that often surrounds it. Managers play a crucial role here. They should be approachable and receptive, creating safe spaces for employees to express their feelings and concerns. This isn't just about problem solving, it's about creating a culture of understanding and empathy, where each person feels heard and valued. Remember, a conversation can be a powerful tool. When we talk about mental health, we acknowledge its importance. We validate the experiences of those struggling. We show them that they're not alone. Through open communication, we can create a more understanding and empathetic workplace. 
Improving mental health at work is a shared responsibility. Recap, foster well-being, balance work-life, provide resources, practice mindfulness, and communicate openly. These strategies can transform your workplace. Don't forget to subscribe for the latest updates on mental health at Gleegro Junction. We're dedicated to keeping you informed and empowered. Take care, and remember, together we can build a supportive and resilient community. Stay tuned for the next Gleeglow Junction.